learn Blue Moon of Kentucky. Zoom in. Here we go. Okay, so let's get into that first section. The first section uh, is what we're just going to call the intro, uh, if you're following along on our Patreon guide. So here it is. I'm going to demonstrate the whole thing. I actually just did a second ago, but I'll do it again. The rhythm, by the way, is down, 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 up, down, up. And you got to work on getting that up to speed, by the way, but I'm going to go twice for uh, A on that. Down, 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 To D twice. Back to A. Then to E. A. Once. And then go to A7. And then D major. minor ones. And then A and E are going to share measure here. I'm sorry, A is going to go one measure. E is going to go one measure. And then A twice. So your intro slowly is A, A, D, D, A, Here's your full chorus, uh, and I'm saying full chorus for a reason, because it is uh, a little bit different than some of the other choruses. Full chorus, here we go. A. a little bit of the remnants of what we just did, right? Um, you can definitely tell some of that's kind of a little bit of a callback. So it's going to be A twice again. Down, 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 down. To D7 twice. You can always just play a D. Anytime I say anything 7, you can always just play its major counterpart. So if I say D7, play a D if it's easier. But I encourage you to try the D7 as well. They're kind of interchangeable in this song, in fact. But here we go. D7 twice. A twice again. The next section is the bridge. I'm going to go and demonstrate that for you and break it down. It's actually probably one of the easiest sections. And it kicks off on a D. It's our first section where it doesn't start on an A. So we got to, I'll just play. Right? It's just a moonlight now, stars shining bright. That's that section. So it's D twice. Down, down. Everything's two measures, two measures for D, two measures for A, two measures for D, then one A, one measure for E at the end. And that's your bridge, every time. The tricky part comes now, okay? It's not tricky in the chords, in fact, it's probably one of the easier sections, but this is that old school songwriting stuff. So the this is, you know how I was saying full chorus, well this is kind of the second half of that chorus, okay? so. We're taking the second half of what would normally be a full chorus. That's the part that comes after this. If you're following along uh, on uh, the chords and the, and the lyric sheet that I provided, then it shouldn't be too hard, but here it is. It's gonna be A. <laughs> So 
So here's a demonstration of that chorus, uh, that half chorus. Um, we're gonna do that real slow. So it's gonna be A. Is that little we're gonna call that the half chorus just to keep things simple after that is essentially just the full chorus again we're gonna do the full chorus but this time it's where the solo goes so this is essentially where that first guitar solo it's gonna be uh, this Keeping in mind, you can do a D7 or anything in there, even E7s. Those are all kind of fun to spice it up if you want to throw this in there. But that's the section happening underneath both solos. Thank you so much for tuning in, you guys. Please like, share, subscribe. I appreciate you watching. And to get the tab, make sure you, or the chords and the lyrics, make sure you click on my Patreon down below. That's all yours. Thanks, guys. See you in the next one.